problem one. Leia has 13 coins, all of which are pennies and nickels. So let's assume that she has X pennies. Let's assume that she has Y nickels. Um, I have no idea why it's not rendering, but um, so we have this. Um, if she had one more nickel than she has now, so that would be Y plus one, right? She would have the same number of pennies as nickels. So this will have to equal X. Now, what is the monetary value of all her coins? Well, if Y plus one is equal to X, then we can write X to be Y plus one, right? And if that's the case, then what else can we say? We can say that we can find the monetary value of everything. Because we know every single penny is worth one cent. So let's write in terms of cents. Right? So if everything is in terms of cents, then that would be y plus 1. That would be the number of cents in value. But then of the nickels, that would be 5y. So this would be your overall value of her coins, which is going to be 6y plus 1. So that means one of the answer choices, once you plug it in to be equal 6y plus 1, must give a constant, a whole number for y. Consider that 6 times 6 is equal to 36, and we have none of them to be 30, uh, 37. Well, actually we do. 37, if it is equal to 37, then y will equal 6, and that would be a valid solution. But let's see if anything else works. 39 minus 1 is 38, that obviously doesn't work. 41 minus 1 is 40, that obviously doesn't work. 35 minus 1 is 34, 33 minus 1 is 32. So only c works, so that's your final answer.